This is FCC Crusader 28 here again, showing you some pretty cool Windows 7 tricks part 2. Let's just get right into it. The first thing I'm going to show you is the invisible folder. Um, you could really use this for anything, any one of your folders. Well, I'm just going to create a new one. So you right click on your desktop, hit new folder, and actually the first thing you want to do is you go to your start menu, type in character you'll see character map you want to scroll down about halfway maybe a little bit more actually about three quarters click on a blank one hit select copy you don't need that anymore so you go over here and you're gonna paste it okay you click off of that now your text is Invisible. Now you right click on the icon, you go to properties, uh, customize, change icon, scroll over until you find a blank icon. Hit apply and OK. Now as you can see, the icon is gone until you roll over it. There it is. And you can just drag that over there. And now you can see right through it. Here, I'll drag it on top of this guy's face. See? You don't see anything until you roll over it, actually. So, that's pretty cool. The next thing I'm going to show you is how to edit a website. Now, you probably know this, but I'm pretty sure you don't know this uh, code by heart. It's pretty long and complicated. So, you can just uh, copy and paste it. It's in the description below. And the first thing I'm going to show you is... Yahoo. And we're going to first copy and paste this code. You just copy and paste it into the address bar. Now it all stays the same, but you can edit. It's not hacking. You're not hacking the server. You're just um, editing what it says. Shoot. Undo. I guess it won't. Well, usually it uh, keeps with the text color and font, but in this case, it's not doing it. Uh, Jennifer Aniston. Um, okay, so you can just. Uh, I'm pretty sure you can't edit where it says Yahoo. Um, now where it says my Yahoo, yeah, I don't know why it's doing that. Uh, you can usually here. Let's, I'm gonna go to my uh, Facebook page. Uh, log out. Um. Okay, we're gonna do it again. Okay, see how it's stuck with the font. You can uh, edit what these say. I had kind of fun with that earlier. Um, and you can take a screenshot and message your friends. Um, it's, like I said, it's not hacking at all by any means, but it's kind of fun little trick. Okay, and the next thing I'm going to show you is God mode. Um, this feature lets you oversee anything that's in your control panel in one uh, long list. So you're going to create a new folder and you're going to put in this code as the title. Type and paste, hit enter, and the icon change to the control panel. And the name change. See? You can Everything that's in your control panel is displayed in one in one little thing. You can search God mode. Um, 
like I said, like I said before, this is a hacking, just like the other one. Oh, I just moved that to my invisible folder. Oh well. <sighs> okay, so we're gonna open up a couple of things for the next one. Um, if you're caught with a lot of tabs open, or not exactly tabs, but windows, and you just want to look at one, a really nice and fun little feature that you can use is um, you hold down the Windows key between the Control and the Alt key, and hit Tab, and it takes you through your different things. Like there's Google, my background, and Camtasia that I'm using. Um, so yeah, this, this is really kind of a funny thing, and you let go, it takes you to full screen, and you can hit uh, Windows button, or actually Alt Tab, and it, do it like that. Okay, uh, thanks for watching. Please subscribe, uh, comment, rate, favorite. Um, yeah, this has been Nico Fi or Long Channel, uh, FCC Crusader 28, uh, signing off.